Hi everyone and welcome to this video. Today we're going to look at how you can transfer a .uk domain away from Fasthosts to a new provider. To start, you need to log into your Fasthost control panel. So go to fasthost.co.uk and click login. And from this screen, select control panel. And from there, just use your username and password that you use to log into your Fasthost account. Once you're logged in, click manage domains. And this is going to display a list of all the domains you've got registered in your account. So we're looking at UK domains today, so I'll pick fhexample.co.uk. Oh, on this screen, go to the contacts and ownership tile and click transfer options. And we want to transfer to a different provider. And this is where you have to do the transfer. So the only thing you need to change is the domain's IPS tag. And what the IPS tag is, is it just denotes which provider is in charge of the domain registration. So at the moment, this fhexample.co.uk has the IPS, IPS tag live domains, which means it's managed with fast hosts. Your new provider will have provided you with an IPS tag. And this is where you enter it here. And then you click transfer out. Now, I'm not actually going to enter a new IPS tag because as soon as you do that and click transfer out, it auto it usually changes automatically and it will be removed from your fast host account straight away. So when you've done that, you then need to go to your new provider and follow their instructions on how to transfer transfer that domain in. Once you've changed the IPS tag, you can actually check whether it's changed or not by doing a whois lookup on the domain. So if we go to a website called who.is, and there's plenty of different alternatives, we can type in the domain name here. So if we go with fhexample.co.uk, And from here, we can see the domain information and we can see under registrar, we can see that the IPS tag is currently live domains. So that's the fastest one. If you update your IPS tag through the fastest control panel, you, we, you won't be able to check any further information through there because it will have been removed from your account. So you do a whois look up on the domain and you'll be able to see if the IPS tag has actually changed. If it hasn't, contact your new provider and just check with them that they have accepted the transfer. And that's all there is to it from, from our side. The next thing you need to do is all with your new provider. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye for now.